Hey everyone, welcome back to the Elden Ring Randomizer. And we're starting right back here in the round table hold. And gonna talk to Roger. Nice to meet you. But now I'm in this sorry I had a little miss, as you might guess. Ah, I know. Is he wearing um you magical battle arts? Would you care to time can move a little conversation? Ah, well done. Something to mark. <laughs> he still gives you. I still can't move. My fighting days are behind me. No need. Uh, oh, the, I, for a second, I saw the bolluses and I thought about poison. And nope, that is not. Oh, there's poison grease. Does he give you anything? No. Lately, of full and so I just want since you're so. Okay. Well, I'm thinking. I was thinking about a little bit about uh, what we could do next, um, and that was one thing that I was. Um, So yeah, there's two ways to get into the deep root depths, and I had to look it up because I, I couldn't honestly I couldn't remember. Yeah, there's one way you can go down, um, you know, through the frenzied flame area to get down there, um, which that of course requires you to get into Lendell, and the other way would be going through Nakron, um, which of course requires defeating Radon normally, and of course now that's Millennia. So, <clears throat> that kind of seems like I'm kind of being, um, that's kind of going to be, to progress, is kind of going to be the next step I have to defeat Millennia. Um, which I think is going to be very difficult right now at the level I'm at, so I think I'm really just going to have to grind levels. So I'm going to have to Try to find some spots to gain levels, and I'm thinking, I'm thinking we go back to Kalid, and I'm thinking actually the Divine Tower of Kalid, going down to the bottom of that that little mini dungeon, and because the boss down there, I think is like 90 or 100k runes. Um, I have no idea what boss it might be, but. I'm thinking we'll head there first to check that out and see kind of what what awaits us. <laughs> yeah, this could either be a great idea or just a horrible idea. <laughs> And the other thing I was actually just thinking about, um, I mean, if this doesn't work out, or if we beat the dungeon, um, oh god. Um, as I was saying, like, if, do I want to go up here? I can't remember. Um, yeah, depending upon what's going on in this dungeon, um, the other thing that, you know, we could go back to Moog and try to defeat Moog. Um, I'm going to go over here first and see what we got for an item over here, because I know that, I remember there's an item over this way. I thought there was. Maybe it didn't, uh... Oh, is it down there? Yeah. Or maybe it's across this way? I, I don't remember. Oof! I 
I really hate this place. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not going to bother trying to find the items unless I um, just happen to see one that is like a legendary or something like that. It's just not worth it. Let's, uh, let's sit for a sec to refill my hearts, my hearts, my, uh, <laughs> my HP. And the, yeah, the enemies here drop a lot of runes also, so jellyfish, okay. Well, I should say normally. since I've done this dungeon. So far, so good, though. And hold on, I'm gonna set my, uh, phone to vibrate so we don't hear notifications. Someone just sent me a text, so... I hate this jump. I really do. Ooh. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's death. <laughs> I really hate this place. Why did I decide to come here? I mean, at least I don't have ridiculous enemies right at the start or anything like that. I don't like you being right on the edge there. Okay, you're gonna drop to your death or something? Oh no, you're gonna sit on the ledge. At least my runes are sitting right there. Okay, let's... Ooh, that was close. Oh my god, I really hate that. I really do. Is this the one you go straight across? Yeah, straight across. Hello. I didn't want to roll and risk falling off the stupid thing. <laughs> oh yeah, this is the shortcut, I think. Right? Where's that item drop down there? Okay, yeah, that goes up that way. Yeah, let's go up there first. Yeah, usually there's, um, what do you call them? The fire monk, whatever, down here. There's a long ladder. Yeah, open the door. Okay, we'll go back down. Alright, what enemy is in here? 
Hello. Okay, so yeah, that's uh, yeah, you walk across this ledge. I remember the last time, I think the last time I was in here, I dropped back down to that same ledge, and that just, you know, takes you around in a big circle. Okay, that wasn't too bad. The enemies here were kind of pushovers, so... That could have been much worse. Granted, I have no idea what the hell is waiting for me at the bottom here. And actually, I, that's a semi-decent number of runes. Is that enough? No, it's not enough to level up. And I don't want to toss, like, 10k runes out there. <laughs> Hello. Bye. Pop this. And I don't know if I'm going to need Mimic. Oh, no. Definitely not. Good lord. Oh, shit. This guy does have a lot more health than he normally would. Ah, uh, too soon. Okay, stop it with the damn meteor attack. Shit. I think I'm gonna use Mimic actually. This dude has enough health where just like I'm gonna need uh, some help. Can he? Maybe you can't even frostbite this guy. Yep. Oh, okay. There we go. Bad damage. Shit. None of that, thank you. Adios. <laughs> A heater shield. Okay. 94k runes was worth it, though. And let's see what's in the chest here, actually. Smithing stone 5, or somber 5, anyways. Yeah, that was definitely worth, definitely worth the coming down here. That's probably, what, like two levels, maybe? Oh, and there's a uh, scarab here. Oh, my God. Root resin. Okay. <laughs> Okay, 
let's actually... I'm thinking... Let's go right back to Moog. Right now. And, um... Have another crack at this. Let's level up. Okay, that's a decent number of levels, actually. Um, I'm going to put two in health and two in dexterity, I think. No, I'm going to change that. Um, okay, that looks pretty good to me. And I want to look at my inventory again. Um, five, seven. I need a six. I need a somber six. Okay, we'll run through here. Mimic. Season. Mimic, what are you doing? Fuck. This dude is an asshole. Good lord, I wasn't standing in his blood flame crap. And I'm out of uh, heals. Oh my god, thank you. Whew. And a fucking butterfly. Oh man, that was an intense fight. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad that we got through that. That was, uh... I think I'm gonna go up damage. Yes. All right, we carry on here in Rey Lucaria. Mm. 
and go up here first. God, that this area is uh, kind of hellish. Holy fuck. Okay. I hate these assholes. Holy shit, that almost killed me. Fucking death blight. I hope that was worth coming up here. Bandit mask. Okay. And golden three. Not worth it at all. <laughs> okay. And there's uh, stuff up here. God, fucking magic mist and poison and rot and Out of here. Oh shit, not watching my health. Large leather shield. Alrighty. Oh yeah, you have to open that from the other side. There is an item up there. Ah, oh, damn it. Carry a night sword. Yeah, it's int. 18 int. A lot of int weapons. Well, at least once we get through this next boss, we'll actually be able to respec. So potentially that will open up my options for weapons a little bit. Leave me alone. And I'm trying to decide if I want to go through this entire dungeon or not. Oh, shit. Stop it with the fucking...
Oh my god. Holy shit, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take her out very quickly, cause... Or, you know, hopefully not aggro her. But she seems to have a ridiculous aggro range. Five. Oh, there's something over there. Oh, there's a legendary right here, too. Margot's Cursed Sword. Oh, nice. Troll's Hammer. I think the Cursed Sword, yeah, Arcane. I have enough decks, though. Yeah, I'd have to see how I could shuffle around um, stats. Yeah, because that, that sword is, is pretty nice. I actually I haven't used it before, but I've heard, I should say, I've heard it's a good sword. I think there is something around the corner here, so I'm going to go check that out really quick. Oh, there's a fucking flower hiding in the... Oof. Is this a Scarlet Rot one? Sporific Grease. Nice. And some cracked crystal. Okay. Let's get past... Oh, shit. No, no. Go away! <laughs> oh, God. Damn it, she's still aggroed on me. Oh, no way. Usually you can dodge it in the corner there. Perceptor Miriam. Oh, of course. It's gotta be you, huh? None of that. Thank you. A whip. Okay, let's go over here and open that door. Granted, the number of enemies... Oh, God. Oh shit, there's a lot of dudes up here. And I'm thinking um, I might want to go up the to that upper deck because there's a, normally a talisman up there. To the the upper floor, sorry. Upper deck, whatever. Okay, 
let's open this here. And I'm hoping that, uh, I'm hoping that you don't actually hear my upstairs neighbors. Um, I'm hearing them walking around a bit. Oh, God. No. Golden Seed and the Red Mane painting. Okay. Redon's Spear. All right, well that was that was worth going up there, I guess. Oh god, who are we going to have in the, this boss fight? See anyone? I'm gonna skip it. The Godskin Duo. Oh god. Uh shit. Dude, this, this fight's gonna be really fucked in here. Just really, really fucked. Godskin duo, Queen of the Full Moon. That's uh, <laughs> that's a thing. Okay, where is there? He is. Okay, you're done. And now on to phase two. This is okay. Who we have for phase two? Loretta. I guess that's appropriate, considering where we're at. Oh, shit. That was funny. Old Fang and the Golden Order Principia. Weave thy might. Awesome. Oh, I want, can you actually respec? Because I don't have the the rune of the unborn thing. Could you actually respec? Okay, I get two levels out of that. Yeah, I think 35 vigor, 35 dex. Where did he flee? 
And let me take a look at... Okay, so we have Morgoth's Cursed Sword. The Hand of Melania, I don't think... I mean, getting up to 48 decks, I would have to, like, really cut my health down to make that, like... Um, to make that, you know, viable, basically. Um, and we got this thing at plus eight, but it's it's a standard. It's not a somber weapon. Um, the Royal Great Sword, and we had Moonveil. I mean, Moonveil might be honestly a good option to use, you know, and go into int. Um, I really can't decide. Yeah, cause for this, I mean, there's not a ton of arcane weapons other than, you know, the Cursed Sword and um, the Rivers of Blood and, like, a few other, and, well, this thing, Bloody Helis. Hmm. And the Mogwin's Sacred Spear. You know, 27... Well, let's let's talk to Renala and see. Do I have the thing for this? No. Is it thy to become? Okay, I can do it. Well, let's let's see what I could do here. Um, because that needed what, like eighteen int. Well, let's bump that back to 35, because um, I'd want to be in the same spot for a few of these, at least. Yeah, I think that would be a good spread, but um, let me let me cancel that. Yeah, there's no way I would get to 48 decks. Um, okay, you need 23 int. And 18 decks. Do I want to do Moonveil? I don't know, honestly. Yeah, because that would be hard to respec also, to get 35 decks and 17 arcane. Um, the other thing, actually... So... Um, this is plus seven, and I don't have, yeah, the highest I could get a new weapon would be to plus five, so I don't think it's honestly, it's actually not worth trying to respec right now, um, because I just don't have... I just don't have the smithing stones to um, get my level up. I mean, to get my web my weapons up. I'm trying to think where else. We could go. There is the dragon um, on the bridge. You know what? Let's go back over there. Yeah, let's go over there and see if we can take out the dragon on the bridge. Because that gives quite a few runes as well. Okay, let's spawn Mimic. Come on, Mimic. Hello, dragon. Which dragon are you? Oh, you're, um... 
You're one of the glintstone ones. Okay, that's not too bad. You're a doula. Ooh, you do a lot of damage. Holy shit. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, where are you landing? All of the way over there. Oh, shit. Ah, damn it. Okay, that was a weird, uh... Oh, and you're sitting on the ledge. Or falling off the, the bridge. I mean, I'm kind of glad his breath attacks aren't, like, connecting, like, at all. Flying. Oh, I dodged that. Come on. Ooh, I'm surprised I even dodged that. Mimic. Oh, you asshole. damage, but I can't do anything about it. Oh, shit. 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 Oh, don't despawn. <sighs> fucking... I wasn't that far away from the fucking area. I hate it when the game does that. I mean, he's almost dead. go. Great enemy felled. A somber four. And a golden rune one. And a good amount of runes. Alright, let's go spend our runes. Bump that up to 38 decks. And I think I'm going to go over to the that minor Erdtree. Um, 
I don't I don't remember what boss was over by the the Erd tree. Yeah, because I mean, I, the majority of the enemies up in like this area, I just give you so many runes. Um, it's definitely worth worth it just to gain levels. Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, let's give it a try. I'm a lot higher level. <laughs> he one shot me. Wow. Um Oh, well actually I just spawned mimic, so maybe I had like no health. Okay, let's try this again. Either that or this is let's Oh my god. Oh yeah, he does a lot of damage. Okay, stop. Holy shit, dude. Yeah, this is gonna be... Let's come back when I have a plus 10 weapon. <laughs> I was doing absolutely no damage at all. Yeah, let's, let's grab my runes and we'll run. Run very fast, far away. No, no, shit. that cracked crystal grave glove war five not bad Oh, there's a rune bear. Nope, let's get let's let's avoid him. Come on. A butterfly. Let's see, which way do I want to go? Um, you know what? Let's go to this Ever Jail. I mean, I'm over in this area, so. And I think there is. Is there a. One of the scarabs nearby. I thought there was a scarab like over near this ever jail, but I could be completely mistaken. Yeah, I don't see one. Alright, let's see what it is. Who are you?
Okay, why do you know fire magic? Who are you? <laughs> Oh my god, I have no, no endurance. I really hate that spell. Battle Mage Adon, <laughs> Adan, or whatever you want to call him. Stone Sword Key and some Golden Runes, and a few runes. Yeah, I was hoping that would give you a little bit more runes, but that's fine. I'm thinking. There is the dragon that is over this way. And we're getting a little bit close to the end time here for the episode, but... I'm gonna take a look. Um, wait, which way is he? Is he this way? No, he's this way. And that's just a fucking ball on the path. Awesome. Is that actually the rot dragon? I can't tell what dragon that is. Okay, we're going to see which one this is. Because this also gives... Oh, is that the one from... Um... From uh... Liurnia? That's normally at the lake guarding the Glenstone Key? Oh, it's a doula as well. <laughs> but this one might have a lot more health, maybe? Nope. Not really. Oh, come on. I dodged that. Yeah, I mean, I, I was doing okay damage. Oh, this is the one. This is a doula from the the Moonlight Altar. Yeah, let's let's not bother with him. He he's got you know really strong attacks and um, does a lot of damage. 
Well, I just did the same thing twice. Um, he has a lot of health and does really strong attacks. I'm going to try to grab my runes, though. And then book the hell back out of here. Surprised he didn't aggro. Alright. Well, I think this is a good spot to end the episode. And I want to thank you for watching. And please like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And I'll look for you in the next episode. Thanks for watching.